Hi guys, today is Friday, um, 19th of February, and we are waiting for my appointment with my lung doctor in Leander Hospital. And um, yeah, so we will know today, um, hopefully, what the blood test was for yesterday. And yeah, um, let's see what the doctor will um, tell me today. But um, I also would like to talk to her or tell her about the side effects that I have right now. The rushes all over my body. And if there's anything they can um, give me to help me with the, uh, with the itch. Because it's really itchy. Um, a cream or a tablet or anything like that. So um, yeah, I'm actually here with Kayo. Oh, we can go. And Tom over there. <laughs> yeah. So they put like a cubicle kind of uh, in the waiting area because of the cor of Corona. But yeah. Um, here. We're at the third floor. So it's a uh, quite a big hospital actually. So. Okay, well, later I will tell you more. Um, Can I go eat soup on me? Hi guys, we just arrived from the hospital and uh, today I got some medicines as well and some cream. I will show them to you later, but today um, we had an early appointment with my lung doctor and um, to discuss about uh, the, uh, my side effects and also what would be the next plan um, because now I am taking the, the Gresso pill for 16 days and um, I was also curious when would be the next CT scan because they mentioned it will be a month but uh, she confirmed today that it will be in six weeks so that would be around uh, second week of March and um, she also um, endorsed me to the dermatologist because of all the rush, rushes that I have at the moment with the, the pimple also in my face and in my head. So um, that's something that needs some attention. Um, so she, yeah, she um, endorsed me to see the dermatologist and see for herself what she can advise and what treatment or what medicine or ointments you know cream that she can she can give me to help me with the with the itch because it's really itchy and um so i have those um also um they took a, a part of my skin for a skin sample so they got it from here so first they put kind of a mark, a very small, um, a very small mark. I, I will also show you uh, later uh, after this video how small uh, the the skin was. Um, but it, it's it's just really small. But um, there's there is also a video. So the nurse was okay with me filming the entire thing. Um, so you will also see that uh, after this video, but um, what they did or what she did, uh, she put first an, an anesthesia and then after that she kind of um, drilled into it um, with this very sharp knife and then uh, cut the, the, the skin and then um, put it in this jar and then they will have to um, study it. I will see the dermatologist after two weeks um, to see if my rushes are getting worse or my I, I will have a bigger pimple because it's also one of their worries that I will have uh, really an acne. So that's that's one thing. Um, so I will see here in two weeks. I will also know what they will find with the skin that they took from me. Um, because it's sample, so they will study it. Um, 
yeah so to, i will show you um two um well they gave me cream this one this cream is actually for um i can apply it two times per day in the morning and in the night in my in my arms in my in my body basically so also in my legs um they gave me two of these because i would be needing more i mean if i have to put it in my arms and in my legs so i need more and it's two times per day so um and uh, once i run out of this i also can request it from our uh, pharmacy here so i can get a supply um another one is this one or maybe this one is better this medicine or uh it's actually not a medicine it's a, it's a, it's a cream lotion like cream and she said to me that i can put it in a cotton but this is only for my face so i'm gonna open it i haven't seen it also so okay oh it's really no nah, it's not a lotion like it's really like a liquid so it's kind of like a toner um, um consistency you know so like waterish um so she said i'm gonna put it in a in, in um uh in a cotton and then i can put it in my face i'm not allowed to put any moisturizer on my own or a toner on my own so i can wash my face um the normal you know with with facial wash um without beads without the fumes um unscented for example and just really the normal if you have a soap that's better um plain uh, soap then that's 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 uh, that would be a, a good one and then i can put this one so yeah so i'm not advised to use any cream toner for them uh, at the moment just to take this um this one and then see how it reacts to my uh, to my rushes and i also uh, have this one this is actually um like antihistamine it's a medicine i can take before i go to bed um looks like this you know the small pill um yeah i remember before when i took antihistamine because i always have allergies um even when i was in the philippines um and this kind of um tablet really knocked me out <laughs> i mean it's like really a sleeping pill for me i it's so hard for me to wake up in the morning get up in my bed you know and i really have to i don't know i, I remember i took one before and i had a meeting with um with a group meeting with uh, sir mike tan and during the meeting i just couldn't i couldn't help myself i was really falling asleep and i am really trying to hold my you know keep it together but it, i don't know it's just not working it was so it it i was just so sleepy and i already thought okay when uh, when i woke up i already thought okay i think it's a bad idea to go to the office today but of course you know um you don't want to say i'm sick or or uh, because i am not sick you know i i'm just really sleepy so i thought yeah it, it's not really a good reason to say to your boss oh boss sorry i can't attend to the meeting today because i'm just really sleepy that's very stupid you know and it's also it's also a bit funny and uh yeah i think any boss would say yeah you know drink uh an espresso or you know uh tons of coffee or whatsoever to help you uh you know um wake up um but anyway um to cut the short story short um i remember i i don't know the side effect of this one for me um or the effect not side effect but the effect of this one for me uh, i just remember um that the last time i took um medicine like this um 
it it really uh, uh, it was really heavy for me. So I really, I if I need to take a medicine, then I have to make sure that the next day I don't have anything early morning, so I can just you know sleep and wake up when I can wake up. You know, um, it's kind of a sleeping pill. So anyway, um, yeah. So. I have also, uh, for the last days, or for the last, uh, I think, the last time I had a video was last Sunday, so it's uh, it's been uh, five days now. Um, I actually collected photos, I took photos of myself, um, and the, the, the rushes I have, you know, and I would like to share that with you guys, because then you know, um, how it all started and then it, how it got really worse um today actually uh, i am also very surprised that uh, i woke up with less um rush um you normally i will wake up and my body will be or my skin uh will be very red itchy and red and um kayo 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 even wachter okay oh yeah can you stay in the bank as your gift because i'm going to bed now yeah mama is nog niet klaar bijna klaar okay yeah? can i go slowly mama said you can after mama will make the video okay as your gift okay yeah thank you well go, go to the bank Go to the bank with your pussy, okay? When mama is clear, I will I will uh, tell you. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, usually I, I um, yeah, I have the rush all over my body and I look like uh, I had, a, I got a sun burnt, you know? Um, and yeah, like a shrimp, like from my face, in my whole body, it's just really red. And today, um, it's funny because uh, I will see my doctor and I'm going to show her the rush that I have. Um, and it's kind of, it looks like they are gone, you know, weird, really weird, you know. I mean, it's not even itchy at this time. So, yeah, I have this one. This is uh, from the um from the skin sample that they took from me uh, this morning but normally you will already see um here it's so red here also it's very red um but at the moment or right now or since this morning actually i woke up with almost nothing but um there's more um reddish reddish uh, spots in my legs um yeah and it, last night it was also terrible i was i was just complaining i was saying to tom oh my god it's so itchy i couldn't sleep i was really um moving a lot you know uh and trying to find a position or uh something that makes me feel comfortable but it was just terrible but yeah well of course um this this itch is not something that um i i would like to have hi tom hi baby <laughs> yeah so um but it's also um it's also something that i'm um thankful for actually because if i would have chemo right now i know that I would have more than just a rush. I know that uh, there will be more side effects and it would, um, it would be really heavy. And, you know, having these rushes and, you know, now I got these creams and I believe they work. And they will also help me with the, with the itchiness. So, you know, this is way less uh, manageable. Um, actually so plus i have this medicine so i think um yeah um i am thankful in that way that um my my side effects are are um mild 
uh, compared to uh, yeah when I have I have chemo for example so yeah I will uh, I will show you the the you know just for you guys to know what the side effects of this medicine um so you have an idea you know how my body looks like in the past days i don't know as well if this will be uh it will get worse in the next coming weeks um i thought that the rushes will continue and just continue and at some point i was thinking oh my god you know if i will keep on having rushes and it's like all over my body and in a month's time I hope there is still spot for them to grow, you know, because it's just like, I feel like they are like everywhere. So, um, but yeah, um, let's see. Um, I will, of course, keep you guys posted and uh, updated with, with um, the progress. And yeah, I, uh, I will show you the, the photos after this uh, video. So... If you guys have any questions regarding the medicine, um, you can also send me a message. So thank you guys and uh, have a good weekend ahead. Bye-bye. No problem. Okay, so first I'm gonna make it. Uh... Are you uh, gonna rip off a skin? Yes, it's a, a little piece. Oh my god. Really little, little, little piece. But first I'm gonna inject uh, and anesthetic. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. And then I will uh, look at a little piece. It's three millimeters. Okay. So this is uh, what we are going to do. But first, the mean thing. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you okay? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. You're doing a great job. Mm. It's okay. You're fine? Mm hmm. Well, I've had a uh, lot of needles in the past weeks. I will believe that. <laughs> But still, I'm not used to it. <laughs> no, no, no. It's a meaningful thing. Okay. You're doing a great job. We're almost done. Great job. Oh, oh. Ah. <laughs> oh big staple. Yeah, I understand. But Burning it's only, or? Yeah. yeah. But it's only in the top layer of the skin. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. In two two hours, it's uh, it's gone, okay. the anesthesia. So. And then I feel the... No, you don't get any pain afterwards. No? No, no, no. It's, it's so tiny, but no. Okay. You won't feel that. I thought that because you're gonna scrape the skin that it would feel yeah. like you got burned or um, um, what do you call that? That you, you cut yourself, something yeah. like that. Oh, uh, I mean, no, no, it's okay. Um, afterwards, it will get a new new part of skin, yeah. and then uh, yeah. And it's also very small. So yeah. You only maybe you feel like pushing on it. Yeah. Yeah. You're fine. Yeah. Okay. I feel a bit uh, ting a tingling uh, feeling. Yeah. But uh, it's yeah. okay. Oh, that was that. It's done. Can you hold it for me? Yeah. Yep. Thanks.
Now I have to put it out. Okay. Yes, thank you. I'm making a look. No, no, it's okay. Yeah, that's it. This thing? Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Hold it for me. Yes, yeah. thanks. Bye bye, I'm not going to see you again. <laughs> So I have to um, hold it dry for the next 24 hours. Okay. Yeah. So no shower. No or shower. Okay. No. And then uh, you can take the, the bandage off, mm -hmm. and then you're fine. Then it can uh, you can make it wet again. Okay. And dry uh, off the air. Yeah. Yes. Great. Good job.